Good morning, frugal friends. I've got Lulu with me this morning. We're going to get out there, see what the bins have waiting for us. Let's go. Uh, good morning, Dollar Tree. It's been a long time. Uh, let's see. There's a chocolate cross. A few chocolate crosses. We'll grab those. Uh, some kind of twine stuff. Maybe a few things in these bags worth looking through. Nothing, Nothing at all? A cup that spilled. She is correct. All right, that's all right. There's a couple of things, a couple of things in the Dollar Tree bin that we'll grab. Let's look behind it. I had someone get mad the other week that I don't clean up every mess that I find. <laughs> Blamed me. In fact, even said, shame on you. As though I should be cleaning up everybody else's messes. It's not enough, frugal friends that we're out here recycling and <laughs> dumpster diving. Nope, it's not enough, Lou. We've got to clean up the messes that everybody else makes too. Forgive me a snarky moment. Oh, ooh, look at that. All right, set you guys right here. Grab a couple of things. Yeah, you can get those chocolate crosses, Lusky. Thank you. Oh, it's, uh, it's curling ribbon, that's great. Yeah, but we can freeze them, chop them up, use them in cookies and cakes. Ooh, I wanted to make chocolate chip cookies, and Raya said, "Make chocolate chip cookies." Well, there you go. Uh, a box? No, it's empty. There might be some more. Yeah, there's some more of the chocolate crosses though. If you can grab those. Lulu's such a great helper. Lulu's gonna try to grab that metal bar there. I need some of those for my garden for the apple tree I'm doing an espalier with. But also, while she's working on that, uh, I wanted to show you I'm trying out the new thermos mug that we found uh, in the college student housing bins. I've got my coffee in there this morning. No, it's like bent and it's stuck. It's bent? All right, I'm gonna go help Lou. Quick stop at the thrift store. Look in the recycling bin. A little feminist. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, seeing what I see. Nothing's jumping out at me. Mm. Yeah. I don't think we're going to grab anything this time, but I'll give you a look. Those who haven't been over here with us before, give you a look at what's going on. And then. We'll take a quick peek into the garbage just so you can see what is being thrown away. Give you an idea that way. Oh, that rocking chair is fabulous. Wonder if I can get it. I don't know why they're throwing that away. Oh, I see. It's broken right there, but we can fix that. The question is, do I have room in the van? Oh, I'll make room. That's fantastic. Let's see if this Dollar Tree has anything for us. There's going to be lots of Mother's Day stuff in the bins next week, guys. So be sure to keep an eye out for that. These are, well, now they're empty. Yeah, I don't see anything worth fighting for. What a beautiful morning, frugal friends. This is Zercher's party store. I can already see right there. We've got like a grass skirt. Might be some other goodies in here. Definitely worth looking. Olivia is getting the grabbers for me. I already went, got the step ladder. Lots of bubble wrap. Hand me a grabber, please. Thank you. This bag here looks good. You can see there's like a grass skirt or something. We'll and a lip. Something. 
in here. Napkins. Aw, class of 2018. Yeah, you'll be finding graduation stuff, guys. For some reason, they've waited till now to clear out last year's graduation stuff. What is this? Window marker. Some banners. Graduation banners. <sighs> Since we forgot to put gloves on, isn't it great that we have these wipes that the bins provided and plenty of hand sanitizer that the bins also provided? Yes, we cleaned up our mess. Yes, we're going to put our gloves on before we get into the next one, huh, Lusky? Yeah. Ugh. Lulu's pretty excited. She found this thing <laughs> in the party stress store bin. Ball. Oh, a stress ball. And you know Lulu loves these kinds of things. Mm -hmm. And when you squeeze them, out come Orbeez. But don't squeeze too hard, huh? Yeah. We don't want to break it. This is a craft store bin. We have some broken frames, framing supplies, and just regular garbage. Uh, dang it. And they've, well, I, don't, I don't know that this was done on purpose, but I can't even put the frames back together because you can see they've been like snapped, not just separated, but snapped. Bummer. We stopped at the Burlington, but the gate's already open and the lid is up, so I am not terribly hopeful. Yeah. I think we got spoiled that one time. There's something in those bags right there that we'll grab. Um, and where I don't have the rake, I really can't grab at those other bags. Uh, but yeah, we'll see what's in this box. I can see there's, there's something. Okay, what is it? Um, oh, it's a, a broken little pot with succulents. They might even be real succulents. Oh, I hope so. Even if they're fake. Yeah, these ones are definitely fake. I'm not sure about the others. But, yeah, I'll take those. Some hangers. Oh, it might be easier just to get this box. Oh, yeah, okay. So that's totally broken. It's a bummer. It's really pretty. But obviously it wouldn't be in the garbage if it wasn't broken. Lulu, will you hold that, please? Best, oh, best daddy ever. It's a mug, and it had this fun handle, but the handle's broken. We might, here, Lulu, we might be able to use it in our mosaic that we're going to be working on next week. Um, but yeah, there's another of those. It's just got a little chip right there. That's not a problem. I don't think I'm going to be able to get any of this with the grabber. Uh, and it looks like it's just packing materials. This isn't one of our regular bins because we know that uh, a fellow diver covers this one. But we were in the area, so we stopped. And I'm happy we did. Lulu, if you'll take that, please. Got those couple of succulent plants and such. I'm interested to see. Let's see. So yeah, that, that's definitely fake. These are the ones I'm not sure about. No, they're, well, yeah, they're probably fake, but we'll definitely use those. So stay tuned to see what we do with them. Another dollar store. Ah, bunch of chocolate bunnies some pretzels looks like they're open uh, that looks like regular garbage yeah we'll grab those bunnies uh, that cross looks like it might have gotten wet but we'll take the bunnies and just like with the oh there's some crosses in that one too some cho regular chocolate crosses yeah we'll grab all that like I said these are great to use in place of chocolate chips in your cookies and muffins cakes whatever brownies Dang it, I miss my rake. Where, Lulu? Oh, thank you, honey. Let's see if we can get this bag out without it falling apart. Oh, I doubt it. Oh, 
still try. <laughs> Whole box of the bunny ones right here. No way, I was actually able to grab it. How do you like that? But I don't know, there might be something in there worth grabbing. And then we'll just grab up all of this. Not the open ones. And we will get these all into zippy bags into the freezer. Chop them up. Good to go. It's even some Tic Tacs. Some more of those eggs. Don't worry, we will clean up. Can't believe I'm still finding Christmas cards. But we haven't found really any Easter ones. That's kind of weird. Well, but we weren't diving last week because we were at Disneyland. Paid for with dumpster diving. So for sure we missed a bunch of Easter stuff. That's okay. We'll live. Before we start going through all the dollar stuff, there is that big metal piece of like rebar. I have plans for that. And there is the rocking chair from the second hand store uh, in their big huge dumpster. So no, I did not take something that was meant to be sold. It was in their dumpster. And it's because this is broken, but we can repair that. And then the metal thing, it was in some random store dumpster. So, all right, uh, let's go see the other stuff. All right, frugal friends, my sweet Olivia, while I was unloading things from the van, she got in here and went ahead and got everything sorted for us. It's fantastic. Look at all these chocolates, my goodness. So we're gonna get our hands washed and get all of these chocolates dumped into some freezer zippy bags. Uh, I don't think I'll bother with chopping them up unless we feel like we need to in order to have room uh, in the freezer. Those are crunchy. Oh, and some of them are crunchy. Okay, so the praying hands are crunchy, and these ones are milk chocolate. And then there's all the bunny ears, stacks of the bunny ears, and yeah, all of this is going to go uh, in the freezer. There's a Ferrer Rocher. That's mine. There's a Happy Valentine's Pugs chocolate. There's a package of Tic Tacs. There are these LA Colors. It's a makeup palette. A um, Christmas card. Some Weiler's Light drink mix. This stuff is so good. There is, um, is it Glade maybe? I don't know, one of them, but a, a smelly refill. There are some of these uh, candy, says candy crosses, and they're in these fun Easter eggs. And we can put the chocolate in the freezer and save these eggs. This one needs to be cleaned. Save these for next year. There is a bottle of Kraft Zesty Italian Dressing. Some hot and spicy Nissen noodles, shrimp with shrimp. There's a thing, I think it might, maybe it's a pen. What is it? Pom pom clip. Hmm. I don't know. We'll do something with it. There are some little teeny tiny Tupperwares. There's a package of Glad double zip sandwich bags. Those always come in handy. There are index cards. Some of these are ruined. Probably we'll have to recycle those ones. But the rest of them are just fine. You can always use index cards. Million uses for those. We have some smiley face, yeah, emoji. Are there three? Three of the emoji tablecloths. There's a smashed up carnival pops, but um, there are a million uses for for the candy even after it's smashed. There is some adhesive uh, sticky back Sparkly stuff, you know, we love sparkles and gems. We can add this to our crafting supplies There's ribbon curling ribbon and I'm gonna see if my sister-in-law wants this roll for the balloons She's doing for my nephew for his graduation there is some Fabuloso floor cleaner, and this is the brand that we use, so that's awesome. Love it. There's this. No idea what that's supposed to go to. Maybe one of you will know. There is a Minnie Mouse um, activity book. Let's see. This. Oh, it's broken. I don't know that we'll be able to repair that. We can try. 
but it's a foam glider, like airplane glider thing. We'll see if we can fix it. Stay tuned for that. I don't know if maybe with some tape. There's poster board, great for when you're doing like yard sales, things like that. There are some frames, and Lulu, show them what you showed me. The glass is not even broken. Yeah, glass that's not broken. Can you believe that? It does happen, frugal friends. It does happen. So a whole stack of frames, that's fantastic. Oh, with this, it comes with the chili sauce packet, so it's your choice if you want to. Oh, so the sauce is separate. You don't have to have it all spicy. That is fantastic. I mean, I'm sure it's still a tiny bit spicy. But... Yeah, there might be a little bit pre-mixed. Um, there is a 4th of July. In fact, I think we found one of these last year, too. But, um, yeah, with a star and a bell. We'll put that up. There's a little shovel thing, maybe. There is a frog. There one, I don't know if I have room to do this right here, but we'll try. Woo! <laughs> What's that? Oh, are there two? Oh, there's the green one also. He's in there. Then there is this hula table skirt. You could actually make like a couple of just regular skirts for costumes, whatever. But it is meant to go around the bottom, or not the bottom, but the edge of a table. And that is from the party store. Then, from the Burlington bin, we rescued these fake succulents. And this one, it really is a bummer because it was a llama. And I love llamas. But, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know. We can try to repair that, but I doubt it. Most likely, we'll just transfer this into a different pot. We have tons and tons. And then these ones are fine. What happened on these, there's just little tiny chips. Where's the one on this? Yeah. And it's even in the back. So these, I'm thinking, might go up on top of uh, the kitchen cupboards where I like to put lots of little tchotchkes and, and fun stuff that we find. Probably that's where they'll go. Maybe even this one. We'll see. Then there was this mug, Best Daddy Ever, and it had pliers for the handle. It really could still be used just like this. I don't think we'll be able to repair that. Um, yeah, I mean, it, it could. The problem is you risk scratching yourself right there. So the other option is just to bust it up, as we'll probably do with this, and add it to the mosaic things that we're going to be working on this coming week. Then, also from the party store, so there's a tablecloth. There are these 2018 banners, and these are the ones that got a little bit yucky, so I've left them in here till I can clean them up. But I'm thinking for my nephew, we could easily turn one of these into a nine. So I'm going to see if my sister-in-law wants some decorations. And then these napkins, they are class of 2018. Uh, it's not worth trying to change them. But these are something that would be great for like a reunion, you know, high school or college graduation reunion. Same with these class of 2018 banners. Um, I'm actually tempted to add one of these to the Disney corner downstairs because I graduated in 2018 and um, you'll remember this tattoo that we uh, got because mommy graduated from college and so we all went to Disneyland the next day to celebrate and so it kind of, I don't know, I think it would make sense to have one of those hanging in the Disney corner because for the kids it was their first time to Disneyland. I don't know. Then there is um, a white window marker. We'll see if that works. I don't know. Stay tuned to find out. Um, and then as far as these other ones, obviously, I mean, yeah, we can use the one for my nephew. The rest of them, I don't know. I don't know. We'll we'll think of something, maybe. We and, and the thing is, things like this, they don't take up, you know, I mean, not much room at all. So these can just be laying somewhere in our crafting supplies in the attic. And then... These, yeah, I think I'll keep one for myself, like I said, and then the other we can put online because when folks are doing reunions and stuff like that, yeah, they'll, they'll be wanting these kinds of items. The problem is stuff like this, these are things you have to hold on to for a while. But again, they don't take up room, you know, they lay flat under other stuff. And yeah, I'm gonna hold on to them just in case. I've held on to some other things like that, banners and whatnot that we found last year. We'll see. We'll see if those end up selling. Uh, please tell me in the comments if any of you have ever sold anything like those for, for that kind of purpose, like graduation, or not graduation, but um, reunions, things like that. Okay, that is all of those, and we have so much from the CVS 
So we're gonna get all this cleared up and then we will jump in. You have got to come back for the CVS reveals. That's I forgot, there was this one lone little uh, golf golfing glove. We'll wash that up. No idea what we'll do with it. Thanks for coming along, frugal friends, with Lulu and I. We just stopped at the P.O. Box. Our uh, P.O. Box address is always in the video description. We collect postcards, uh, magnets, keychains, and little spoons. Uh, we stopped and picked up a couple of boxes. We will open those tomorrow, Monday, during our live stream at 7 o'clock. So hit your notification bell so that you don't miss that. And uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, that button's right down there. We'll see you all real soon.